As the 0-1 is hit sharply right side of the infield, diving stop and off the glove of Hilgore. And now Vic can trot home, and that'll be an RBI single for Martins. First six have started every game. Bottom third, Rachel Lawson mixed up the lineup a little bit. Bunt is put down, and that's going to bounce off the back of Babs. And coming in to score is Stoddard, and Babs is on her way to third, and she's going to slide in safely. And that's exactly what the base hit bunt does. It puts pressure on the defense to make a play. The catcher, Cawthorn, unable to pick an inside or outside throwing lane. When that happens and the runner's throwing, running down the middle of the path, the first base, it's up to the first baseman to choose in or out. She does not, bounces off her helmet, results in a three bagger for Dabs. That's got to give you some momentum going forward. Now a little dribbler back to the circle and a low throw again from Dalgar, but they do get the runner at first. But Kentucky does score this time as Johnson comes home. So it's four to nothing. And Dalgar, one right back to the circle and then one through the left side of the infield. And this one is roped into right center. A long run and making the catch on the track is Scalzidi. Both runners will tag as Smith comes in to score. And the Wildcats put another run on the board to increase their lead to five. Bounce back here 2-1. Popped very high, left side, is it gonna stay in play? And yes, it is. What a catch from the left fielder, Bailey Vick coming over into foul territory. A nice job, not only using her speed, but also her power. Bounces it right back to the circle, and Dolgar decided to come home, and the throw's not in time. And now they've got Vick in a rundown, and then they throw back over to third to try to get bad sleeping, and she's in safely, and that allows Vick to head down to second. Second and third, so not labeled an error, but definitely a miscue. This one ricochets off the glove of Dalgard. Everybody's safe, another run comes home, and Kentucky is now up seven to nothing. Uh, very tough to stop. And Martins now shoots one in the gap, and this is gonna score a pair, as coming around third is Vic, and following her is Riley Smith, and that is a two-run double for Alex Martins, her third hit of the game. Her second and third runs driven in, and swung on and missed in a fitting way for Shorman to end her day by striking out Gabby O'Reilly. And TJ, just a dominant performance by the Kentucky right-hander in the circle this afternoon. 